It's amazing, really. Uh, like you said, Savan uh, first invited me to participate, and uh, she sent me images of the space. And just seeing the images, it's like, wow, it's fabulous. I mean, what artists don't, you know, wouldn't want to do uh, an installation in a church, a 17th century church that had its start in the 11th century? It was fabulous, right? So I see the images, uh, you know, of the space, and. I've seen um, uh, other artists who've done installations in here. I said, like, wow, this is great. But then when I came to the space, it was even better. I mean, the images don't do it justice. It's just an amazing space. I mean, you can still see some of the frescoes that were, that, that's still in the space. And uh, so I had to consider what I was gonna make for the space, taking the space into consideration because it's a collaboration between the artist, me the artist, and the space itself, you know? And um, so I thought about bringing some work. So I had to figure work that would work in the space, uh, the drawings in particular, because I wasn't gonna ship uh, sculptures because my sculptures are too big, they're too bulky, cost too much money, right? So I figured I'd bring uh, seven drawings to, uh, to hang in the space. And one of the seven drawings I did specifically for the space itself. And it's actually the, the tallest drawing I've ever done. I mean, it's over 14 feet long, right? And um, it has several uh, portraits of me in that drawing. It's, uh, it's light reflective. It's up, uh, you know, up in front of me. Uh, you probably could see it uh, behind me uh, on the altar and you can see through it, right? So it's, it's, it's having this dialogue with the, uh, with the space itself. And then that piece, um, the title is, I am a bush doctor, comma, one halo period. And uh, the bush doctor refers to um, Peter Tosh, who sings this song about being a bush doctor in, in Jamaica, right? And it also refers to my dad, because my dad was sort of a bush doctor himself. I mean, he never taught me, which I, which I regret, you know, but he used to make all these various concoctions. If you have a little ailment here, a little ailment there, he made a concoction and give it to you. I mean, and it used to work, right? He used to make snake oil, right? And I didn't know any of this until I was, you know, a, a mature man, right? He didn't teach me any of that stuff. But so it refers, you know, like a lot of my work, the, the title itself, for the exhibition and the, the, the drawing that was done for the exhibition refers to my culture, it refers to music. Music is, is very important in Jamaica. Uh, it refers to art history too because in that piece itself there's a, a portrait of me where I'm, I'm hooded and I'm shrouded and I'm stooped over and that refers to Giotto, you know, one of his um, 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 frescoes where he would oftentimes he would have shrouded figures in his in his frescoes where sometimes you couldn't see the face or you just see the back and they're humped over. So that kind of refers to that, you know. So there's another piece that's also on the altar that I believe is from 2007. It's um, it has uh, a reproduction of uh, Albrecht Durer, the the great German uh, painter in it, and. Um, that goes back, that piece goes back to uh, Italy again, actually, because when I lived in Rome 20 years ago at the American Academy, I won the Rome Prize, I started doing these, um, these drawings with charcoal and, um, and graphite, tin foil, you know, because of the reflection, you know, and Caravaggio um, uh, postcards, right? So it's me articulating, you know, the Baroque uh, through living in, in, in Rome, and the dialogue with Caravaggio. So I figured that this piece in particular would work in the space because it, it is about medieval work, um, it's about spirituality, it's about the reflection, um, and it, 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 it goes back to works that I've been doing for 20 years. So oftentimes when I do an exhibition, I like to put new things all the sculptures that are in the space, they're all new. They were done specifically for the space, inspired by the space. But also, I like to bring past works, like some of these drawings that are here, the light reflective, where you can see through, and also the, uh, the, the, the one on the altar, 
with the, with the graphite and, and the tin foil that goes back to works that I was doing in the, actually that started in the late 1980s into the 90s and when I was in Rome. So, um, yeah, so it's a totally um, inspired uh, exhibition for me.